hi everybody welcome back to today's video i'm going to show you how to create this real quick let's start with photoshop without further delay let's click on create new now this is really going to be packed it's a lot of secrets i'm going to reveal to you don't skip it pay attention and i'm sure you're really going to learn a lot today so let's set aside to 2000 let's set aside to 2000 why because the social media post okay let's set here to 300 for maximum quality let's just call it social media post right and then let's click on create also we need our line it's really important so let's go to view let's go to new guys layout let's set it to six six let's set here across to 0 0.3 and then let's click on ok now let's start with the image background i'm going to file and i'm going to place embedded and then let's go back all right so i'm going to click over here i'm going to click on place and guys i'm going like this looks cool but i'll go here to adjustments i'll go to gradient map and i'll click over here i'll set it to some few colors here guys pay attention to it i'm going to set here to f7 6 e 0 0 good and then i'll click over here i'm going to set the color code to f f c 5 9 0 all right and i'll click on ok now let's pull these two in the group let's call it bg that's going to be our background for today now let's start with our text i'm going to type over here and then i'm going to pick month then i'm going to paste it there i'm going to be using a font i use once in a while i'm going to use steel fish okay so steel fish let's use any of them i'm going to use both for now let's also click here let's just do color white it really needs to be visible for the meantime and then this is what we're going to do okay we're going to set the font to a very ridiculously big amount 210 good we're going to set it to extra bold make sure italics is off set the side to minus 20 and on top of that make sure it's all caps here just in case all right so um that is it for the meantime let's just click here Bring it here control t make sure it's in the middle this way okay so is it i'm going to put it in a group i'm going to call it month but there's still more to be done about it so i'll click over here and then i'm going to click on my text tool guys and then i'm going to type somewhere here good now i'm going to pick that and i'm going to paste it there I'll go here and I'm going to set it to Montserrat. Now the size, I'm going to reduce the size drastically to 14. Okay, or even something smaller. Click on my move tool and then I'm going to move it up. Should be a little bit up. Okay, now also the styles here. Guys, I want us to set it to bold. And I want to set this side, the tracking to 200 to give it some spacing around it all right and then make sure it's all caps as well you're going to click here you're going to set it to color black for the meantime make sure guys it's middle aligned it needs to be middle aligned also make sure the month is middle aligned good now you're going to select two of them you're going to drag them down perhaps perhaps here yeah, is good now click on your text tool and type here I'm going to pick May and I'm going to paste it down. I'm also going to be using the font called uh, it's not here Autographia. Yeah, Autographia. Make sure caps log is off. Let's go to the font size. Okay, and set the font size is 225. Nice. And then click here and then let's set it to this color code 741B. Zero, 00 okay click on your move to and then just move it there somewhere here all right so i like the way it looks so welcome to a new month may all right so we are done with that basically done with uh you know that side of it okay so the other thing is we can bring in our image and the rest of the details let's bring this one there nicely done 
put it in a group let's call it image now we can also bring in some few uh you know emojis or whatever it is that we want to bring i'm going to click over here all right that's good i'm also going to go there place embedded i'm going to pick this one good and i'm going to the same place again place embedded i'm going to pick this small one all right now these motions gives it a, a different outlook so let's call it motion okay let's close this one now let's go back there let's add our telephone numbers and our details okay so there's it our telephone numbers and our details enter let's drag it down here Control h okay i feel like this is good all right let's call it tail then we need to add some glues as well to do that we're going to create a new layer drag it outside out okay Blue. um let's pick let's pick let's pick around here let's see okay make sure caps lock is off click here and set it to screen sorry set it to screen nice uh, that's it okay the first place we are going to put it is somewhere here duplicate it make it twice good so that is good now you can duplicate the two of them again and then we can bring them somewhere here and then reduce the opacity of both okay i like the way it cast nice shadow on the face okay so let's put everything in a group and let's call it glow does it cast shadow cast light lights rather i wanted to say that <laughs> all right so uh let's go back again let's add one more magic to it let's add this to it all right and then let's go here let's set it to screen now let's see where can we push it all right so what i'm going to do is i'm going to give it a mask and then i'm going to clean this side all right so let's see how we can move it about all right so okay so i think this is better let's put it in the group let's call it holographic now let's merge everything together Control alt shift and then e right click it and convert to a smart object good now i want you to go to filter let's go to camera raw filter and then let's do some few magic tweaks over there the contrast we're going to set the contrast to 48 then the highlight you're going to send the highlight to 17 then the shadows you're going to set the shadows to 13 and then the white to minus 32 let's scroll down the blacks over here let's set the blacks to uh maybe around minus 32 as well then the clarity let's set it to five three okay so then that is it for this place let's go over here to the adjustments and then let's just play with a few of the hues um now the situation here the yellow i'm going to set it to 35 let's go to the green i'm going to set it to 40 let's go to the aqua i'm going to set it to 48 and then the blues i'm going to set it to 32 i'm going to leave the rest the same and i'll go to fx or effect and then the green i'm going to set it to 22 and then the vignette i'm going to set it to minus 13. then i'll click on uh let's see okay good but uh i can give it a mask and then hit this side okay like that i don't want this side to be too deep all right so guys now this is how you create something like this if you love this video please hit the bell icon and subscribe to this channel as well don't forget to give this video a like don't forget to comment under this video i love you all see you in the next one peace out